are we all doing this morning? I'm slowly but surely getting better. This cold, like it just like hit me, hit me hard. We're pushing through. If you are joining me live this morning, you're gonna work out with me. Just let me know you're here. If you're doing it later, just hashtag replay below so that I know you stopped by and actually did it. You guys created this workout. So if you hate any part of it, you can talk to each other about it. I did this in my Christmas accountability challenge and it was so fun to get you guys to all pick your exercises and you guys create the workout. Um, I am still a little bit congested. Um, if I push too hard, it's really hard for me to breathe. So I may be queuing a little bit more breaks than normal today, but we're gonna do our best to push through. You are gonna need heavy set of dumbbells all the way down to light. I have four different sets. I have 20s, I have 15s, I have 10s, and then I have all the way down to threes, and you're gonna need your long band. If you did not see, I got a new print. It's so fun, so we're gonna play with it a little bit today. I'll give you guys a couple seconds to grab your things. We have 30 minutes together. We're gonna do a nice big warm up. We're gonna do our workout. We're gonna do a nice stretch. And you are out of here. And we're gonna do our best to push through today. I could feel my voice slowly crackling away. So if I sound like a crazy person, that is why. Not that I don't always sound a little bit crazy. All right, make sure you guys have your stuff together. Let's get warm. We are gonna work everything from shoulders all the way down to our toes today. So nice warm up. We wanna make sure we get everything nice and warm. Let's start with some arm crosses here. Chest up, shoulders back. Just breathe. Sometimes all it takes is to show up. Like, it's been a struggle for me this week. The motivation is not always going to be there, especially when you're feeling a little bit under the weather. But what makes us stronger than everybody else is we actually show up. Even if we have to drag ourselves out of bed, because let me tell you, I had to drag myself out of bed this morning. But I got up and I got it done. We struggled through, but doing a little bit is better than doing nothing. Three, two, one. Beautiful. Shake that out. Let's go into some nice big arm circles here. Get that full range of motion. Whoo! How are we all doing this week? How are your bodies feeling? Sore? Tired? overwhelmed. Good. That's the best feeling. Good. Let's reverse it. Nice big backwards arm circles here. Try and get that full range of motion in your shoulder joints. Don't just think about your arms. Think about it all coming from the shoulders here. Good. 15 seconds here. Three, two, one, beautiful. We're gonna go into some nice hip openers. So we're gonna go knee up all the way around. Does anybody think we should do everybody's exercises but Amy's crazy hit suggestions? I almost like bypass to those. <laughs> My sick body is like, nope. Should we do a vote? Should we vote out hits today? Anybody? Yes? I'm gonna take it you're all being like, yes, no, no hits. Except for Amy, she's like, I want hits. <laughs> Three. We always gotta call her out. Two, she's crazy. One, go, let's go into some leg swings, front to back, belly button is pulled in. Nice hip opener here. 
I see some comments on the screen, so I'm assuming you're agreeing with me, so we're going to go with it. I can't see because my phone's too far away, but... Good. Make sure that upper body is nice and tight, just working on that hip here. We got lots of squats today. We got deadlifts. I put in all sorts of deadlifts because I know how much you guys love them. So we're going to kind of do a little bit of everything with those. Three, two, one. And then maybe we'll save the best for last. Good. Other side. Whoo. My hips are tight. Beautiful. Make sure your toe is pointed up at the ceiling. Get that full flexion. Good. About 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Beautiful. Facing forward. We're going to take left leg up. Nice big pull. We're going to flip it on back. Nice quad stretch. Whoo! Traveling so hard on my body. My body does not like to sit. <laughs> and when I'm forced to sit on like an airplane or something, it struggles. It does not like it. I know, crazy. Hey, Amanda doesn't like to sit. Who would have guessed? <laughs> Good. Try not to hold it for too, too long, as again, we want to lengthen the muscles. We don't want to completely relax them yet, because we're going to put them through some work. And relax. Beautiful. All right, today we are doing a no-repeat workout. We're going to go from exercise to exercise. I am going to time them, and I am going to cue little tiny breather breaks in between, just so I don't completely over overwork myself because that may happen all right we're going to start with squats when i say on to the next we're going to go squat jumps and we're going to go into squat pulses and then we're going to take a little break yes good so just regular squats no band no nothing let's go so squats belly button is in chest is up Shoulders are back, knees are not caving inwards. Nice and tight and controlled. Good, we're starting off with a banger. Good, no band though, like you're welcome. You're welcome. Leg day tomorrow. I didn't want to like too, too tire you guys out. <laughs> Good, right up, right down. Remember, you do not lock out your knees at the top. Nice soft bend. And breathe. My heart rate is already getting up there. It's like the nice thing about being congested is your heart rate gets high real quick. Three, two, one. Beautiful squat jumps right away. If the squat jumps are too much, then you just squat. Good. Woo. Yep. From here, we're going to go down into pulses. Oh, it's going to burn. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it up for a sec. Feet hip width apart. Drop it down. And we're pulsing. Try and put your mind in your glutes here and think about your glutes doing the pulses. Try and take it out of your quads. Good, breathe. Woo! Booty is on fire. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. You have 30 seconds to get your legs together. We're going to do the same thing. But we're gonna go sumo, so nice and wide. It's gonna be a struggle today, you guys. If I 
can do it right now while not being able to breathe. So can you. All right, feet outside of hips. Toes are forward. Squat it down. Oh. Yep. This is going to hurt. Those inner thighs, though, we don't put a lot of focus into them. But those inner thigh muscles, woo, they're beautiful. Good. So here, I want you to think about using your inner thighs and your glutes. Good. Toes are forward. Mind is in that booty. And those inner thighs, you are not locking your knees. Nice soft bend at the top. 10 seconds. And we're jumping, feet wide. Three, two, one, right away. Good. I want to see you all the way down. All the way down. Good. Power on the way up. And remember to land nice and soft. Good. 10 seconds. We're pulsing. I know, I know, I know, I know. It's burning. Three, two, one. Wiggle it out. Feet wide, toes forward, down, pulse. Do not let your knees fall together. Keep them out. When we start getting tired, our knees tend, tend to cave together. Good. Can we go lower? Yes, we can. Woo! Three, two, one. Relax. 30 seconds. We're gonna go long band of deadlifts. Woo! And I'm gonna use this new long band. It's tight, it's not loosened. Just breathe. My heart rate is at 162. <coughs> Didn't even have any pre-workout. Just meant to get sick. Okay. Long bend underneath the front of your feet. Chest up, shoulders back. I do not want to see this. Your knees do not move. It is all glutes. I still see you guys going forward. Fix your damn form or send me a video so I can help you fix it. Seriously, so many of you are still doing deadlifts wrong. Okay, you're gonna grab each handle, chest up, shoulders back. You're gonna pull up and squeeze. Push your hips back. We don't have a cave. Our core is tight. We are not locking out our knees at the top. Nice soft bend. We do not flatten our booty because that looks absolutely ridiculous. We are not doing all these squats to have a flat ass. Good. Push hips back, squeeze your glutes, bring it up. Push, pull. Good. Nice and controlled. Stay with me. Yes, you can. Push it back. Squeeze. Back. Squeeze. I know we're here for a little bit, so get comfortable. Woo! On fire. Good. Push your glutes. Squeeze. Feel it yet? Good, we're gonna keep on going. Woo! Long bend of deadlifts. I think I like more than dumbbell deadlifts just because you get to choose your own resistance and that tension. Woo! Yes, good. 25 more seconds. I know we're here for a bit. Get comfortable. You guys ask for deadlifts, you're getting them. Good. 15 seconds. Again, notice my knees 
are not moving. It is all in my glutes. I do not feel it anywhere else. Last one. Shake it out for a sec. Keep that long back. We're gonna go into single legs. Woo, booty. Long band and deadlifts are definitely one of my favorite glute exercises. All right, so same thing. Just long band is gonna go under one foot. We're gonna have one foot behind. Again, if you find it too easy, just grab the band a little bit lower. If you want it easier, grab it higher. I personally am probably gonna grab it a little bit lower just because I need a little bit more tension with one leg, but if you do not, then you grab it a little bit higher, okay? You choose your resistance. So, one foot's gonna go back. You're gonna balance on the top of your foot. It is just balancing. I do not wanna see like full pressure, just balance. Chest up, shoulders back, push. Pull, same thing we just did. We're just using one leg. I do not want you to feel anything on your balancing leg. It is just there for mental support. Good, pressure all in that front leg. It should already be crying. I know mine is, especially after two and a half minutes of long banded deadlifts. Good, over halfway, yes you can. Push it back, squeeze. And somebody tells me they cannot get fit from home with a band. Are you crazy? Do you feel that burn right now? And someone says you need to go to a gym? No, nope, nope, my leg is shaking. Good, stay with me one more. Woo. Okay, right away, we're going other side. Front foot, balancer, push. Again, you choose your resistance here. If it's too easy, grab that band a little bit lower. If your leg is not shaking like mine, challenge yourself a little bit. Tomorrow's leg day, you're gonna be like, what in the hell did we do this the day before? You chose it, you guys, you chose it. Good. My little Frenchies are being my alarm upstairs. I <laughs> can hear them barking. I think I heard someone at my door. Whoo! Push, pull. 15 seconds. Yes, you can. Belly button in nice and tight. You should not feel this anywhere near your lower back. Good. One more. Whoo! Long band. Off to the side, we are gonna go dumbbell deadlifts now. So, you're gonna choose a heavy weight just because you did such a hard resistance with the long band. I want you to challenge yourself a little bit with your weight. Breathe. A little break. We're over halfway down the workout. Halfway left though. I'm gonna do everything in my power to make everything a little bit longer so the burpees on the end of my list, we don't get to those. <laughs> They're on my list, but I'm praying everything else takes a little bit longer. All right, heavy dumbbells. Again, we're here for a little bit. So get comfortable, feet head width apart, slight bend in your knees. Knees do not go forward, glutes go back. Those dumbbells should be dragging along your legs. Dragging, dragging. Our shoulders are not rounded forward, they are pulled back. Chest is up. You do not need to drop all the way down to your toes in a deadlift. It depends on your flexibility. You should be able to push your glutes so far back that you should not be able to get all the way down to your toes. Glutes, pull, yes. Very nice. Woo! Mind is in your booty. Squeeze your glutes from the bottom. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze your glutes from the top. Good. 
Dumbbells are touching your legs. Do not let them escape. Drop, pull. Notice how slow and controlled I'm going. Some of you guys go so fast. Like, no, no. Slow and controlled, always. Good, 20 more seconds. I know, I know it's getting hard. Stay with me. Booty. Good. After this, we're going to take a little break from glutes. One more. Drop. Pull. Drop the dumbbells. All right. You're going to need a light to medium. We're going to go hammer curls. Yes. Can you hear my dogs? I wonder if someone's in my yard. Mm. All right, hammer curls. Three, two, one, let's go. Straight up. Good. Remember, elbows stay tight. They do not swing forward. It is slow. It is controlled. We are not here. If you are doing this, Stop. Drop your weights. I better not have one client that is swinging like a swing, okay? No. No. And if you are, don't tell them you're in my group. No swinging allowed around here, you guys. Form over weights. Stop trying to lift super heavy when your form is not good. And I know a couple of you are guilty for it, so stop. I have eyes everywhere, everywhere. Good, let's do three more. Woo, two, one. Oh, good. All right, from here we're gonna go into a shoulder press. Again, try and choose a lighter weight just because we are going timed here and we're going for quite a decent amount of time. I'm gonna go with 10s. My shoulders are pretty tired from this morning. All right, three, two, one. Above, dropping just below shoulders. Press, belly button is in. If you notice yourself rounding in your back, then you're gonna take one foot back. This is going to stop you from rounding your back and it's gonna help you keep your core engaged. So if you struggle with keeping your core tight, doing a staggered stance is a really good option for you. Good, nice deep breath in. Breathe out, push. Woo! Yep. Stay with me, we're here for a little bit longer. Get comfortable. Good. Anyone else's shoulders tired from this morning? Just me? Whoo! Good, let's do one more. All right, to the top. Drop them. We're gonna go into a little punching circuit. Something a little bit fun. I am gonna choose light weights here. I do suggest you do the same. But if your arms are not tired from this morning, then you can choose heavier. Up to you. We have 10 seconds and we're just going to start with left and right punches and then we're going to go into a little bit of a circuit. All right, let's go. I want full extension out right back to your face. If you've ever done some sort of boxing or something before, I'd love to see you in your boxing stance and those dumbbells pulled right back to your face. If you are really tired and the dumbbells are too much, that's okay, drop them. Good, in five seconds, we're gonna go really fast. Three, two, one, go. Fast, fast, I do not want no pauses. Right back to your face and out. Woo, yep. Stay with me, dumbbells up nice and high. Again, if it's too much, drop them. 
five, four, three, two, one. Relax. We are then going to go hook, hook. Yes? Good. Shake it out for a sec. You got 20 seconds. We're going to do our hooks. Same thing. We're going to go nice and slow for the first 30. Really fast for the last. All right, get into your stance, dumbbells up, you're gonna hook. So, you're gonna come down all the way around like someone is standing here and you're punching them, okay? Put some power into it. If you have some sort of anger, you're stressed out, you're emotional, your anxiety is high, you're a little depressed because winter sucks. I was gonna say a bad word, but I know I can't. Then put some power into it, you guys. You guys need to learn how to let your emotions out on your mat. And let me tell you, your day will be so much better. Let's go fast. Fast. Good. Fast with proper form. So still all the way back to your face. But put some little speed. Good. Power. The dumbbells are too much. Drop them. Woo! Three, two, one. Relax. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to go uppercuts. Arms are getting tired. How we feeling? Fantastic. Getting all our anger out. Seriously, you guys, if you are holding something in, let it out. Let it out. If you are holding so many emotions in, when you are working out, you should almost be crying because you are letting them out. You've got to stop holding on to stuff. Three, two, one. Let's go. This month, January and February, are the hardest month for absolutely everybody especially being in the north. We are trapped in our damn houses. It is cold. We don't get much sun. So it's in a very, very emotional time. So show up for yourself. Get outside when you can. It is beautiful today. Get outside. Good. Let's talk about these. So you're twisting. And you're coming right up. There's someone in front of you. You are hitting them right in the jaw. So if you're mad at somebody, let it out. Good. Let's go fast. Fast. Let's go. I just want to see the light twist in your body and I want it all in your arms. Good. Yes, you can. Let's go. Woo! Slight bounce, as if you were to have like a little bag and you're smacking it. Five, four, three, two, one. Drop them. Check it out for a sec. We are gonna do lap pull downs next. So, long band. We're gonna grab it nice and wide. We're going to pull all the way in front of our face and make a nice W. Think about using only lats. Again, when you're at the gym, that cable machine using the lat pull down, exact same thing with a long band, you guys. Don't give me excuses as to why you cannot work out with a damn band or you can't get to a gym. Mm-hmm. All right, three, two, one, let's go again. You choose your resistance. You want it a little bit harder, grab it a little bit closer. Belly button is pulled in, chest is up, shoulders are pulled back. I want you to think about using your lats here and only your lats. This is the last exercise and we stretch. Stay with me. Woo, yep. Pull. Focus on those lats. Squeeze. Arms are tired, I know. 
I know. These are burning. Last one. Pull down and squeeze. Drop it. That is it, you guys. Let's go into a nice stretch. That was fun. Left arm over and across. Nice big pull. If anyone wants a couple Frenchies, let me know. They're still barking up there. I don't know what they're barking at. They're barking at something. They're crazy. They are crazy. There's a cat too. There's someone, one of my neighbors has a cat and it likes to like sit outside the window and it just like taunts them. <laughs> Other side. It's a really nice cat, whoever's cat it is, but it just sits there and it taunts them. It's mean. How are we feeling? Fantastic. That was good. I think everything in our body by Friday should be freaking tired. If you are not tired by the end of tomorrow, what have you been doing? Good, relax, let's take left leg up. Belly button in, nice big pull. This cold needs to go away. I go on vacation next weekend, so I'm doing everything in my power to get better because nobody wants to be sick on a vacation. That is not fun. Good. Pull that knee up and in. Let's roll out that ankle. Still barking. <laughs> oh. Good. Relax. Other side. Let's pull that up and in. Roll it out. Good, flip it around, nice big pull, belly button is in nice and tight. Look at that, we didn't do any hit exercises. Well, we did like squats and squat jumps and I guess that's kind of that, so I guess we kind of did, but we did it first, so we forgot about it. Burpees could stay on that list till next time. <laughs> You're welcome. Three, two, one, relax. Beautiful work, you guys. That is it. That is all. Today is done. Seriously, you guys, get outside. It is so nice outside. It's a little bit windy, but still, like, it is beautiful for January. Get out there and, like, honestly notice the difference in your mental, in your mental health, I guess. I was going to say clarity, but same thing. So get outside. Enjoy the weather. Enjoy your Thursday and have the best day ever.